Okay, hello and welcome. In this video, I want to show you how you can do a data exchange or use shared folders in Linux using QEMU if you have uh, Linux on as your host system and also as your guest system. Everything I describe here in this video will be available in this blog post here. Here you find all the steps and commands. I will put the link in the video description. Okay, here we go. Uh, this is my Linux system here and I have a Linux host system as well as an installed QEMU with a Linux guest system here and this Linux guest system should be able to access files on my host system let's get started okay first we shut down our virtual machine as you can see uh, I have shut down my virtual machine here and now we have to install word IO FSD this um, package here on your host system if you do not have installed it yet so run this command sudo apt install word IO FSD and once this is done we can continue by adding the file system to the guest okay in word manager we open our virtual machine and click on the settings here and the first thing you need to make sure is under memory you have to enable shared memory here this checkbox must be checked on otherwise you will get an error message next we click apply and add hardware here we select file system the driver word iofs that's correct and under source path you enter the path you want to share or with your virtual machine in my case here i want to share my home folder so i just type in my home folder path here home da and as a target path we enter a name of our liking in my case i just use shared here we will need this later to mount our shared folder into the guest system we can also check here if you want to only have read only access to our files here otherwise we click finish here we go now we start our virtual machine open a terminal and now we first create a folder where we can mount our shared folder in for example, in my case, I want to create this folder here under MNT shared. Once this is done, we can now mount our share here. So we enter sudo mount minus T for type word IOFS. That's our virtual IO file system shared. That's the name we have given our share and the target location here. That's the folder we just created and once this is done we can now open our file manager here and our home folder or hosts system home folder should appear here now and as you can see uh, i have no access to my home folder in my virtual machine there's one problem if i restart my virtual machine as you can see my shared folder is now empty again so i have to rerun the command in order to co uh, mount the shared folder here but uh, i can also do this um, when starting the machine so i can add this um, mounting to our fs tab file here so I here we go we've restarted our virtual machine and uh, let's check if our shared folder is available so let's move to the folder here and as you can see our home folder is now available when we reboot our system okay well that's it that's how you can do data exchange between your virtual machine and your host system in linux